Welcome back to the All Ball Pod. Today, we are reacting to our Champions League group predictions we made, oh, I guess, three months ago at this point. Ago, yeah. yeah, it's been a long time. Time flies. But <laughs> it was a pretty exciting group nonetheless, I think. There's a lot of upsets, I want to say. Yeah, it wasn't bad. It the group bad. of death. It lived up to expectations, yes. I think. Very surprising. I don't think anyone could have predicted what happened there. But we can go ahead and get started. Group A, of group course. A. Bayern Munich tops it. Man United. Gala then Copenhagen mm -hmm. I, is what I had. Wait, you said oh Gala? No, I I said Bayern, oh. Man United, Gala, and Copenhagen is oh, what I had. Is what you had? Okay. Well, obviously that was very wrong. I was very wrong. The group obviously finished with Bayern top, Copenhagen second, which was a surprise. We I had them last. Gala third, Man United finishing bottom of the group. Look, I was look. I only got one out of four. I only got Bayern right, but at the end of the day, I did have Gala second. I knew United were not going to qualify. I knew it. It was obvious, bro. They're not. They were they're garbage, and they bo bottom of the group showed it. You know what I'm saying? But I had them third. Yeah, I mean, there's no excuses for me. I'll be <laughs> honest. I was riding hot in Ten Hag three months ago, but a lot can happen in three months, and this is what happened, bro. It's been downhill. It's been downhill. It's from, unfortunate. From, from there, Group B. This was a solid group for me. The it finished with Arsenal top, PSV second, Len third, and then Sevilla bottom. Mm -hmm. I got the top two right. That's all that matters to me. Arsenal and PSV. I had those two first and second. I had Sevilla third, Len last. I had Arsenal and then PSV. I thought Sevilla was gonna do something. You know they nah. had that. They had some sort of European heritage. Adding Europa Sergio League though, this, yeah, yeah, this is different. But still, they're still they should be better than Lens, bro. But they signed Wash to Ramos. They were never gonna. Nah, qualify. he's a beast, bro. Nah, he's nah, a beast. Nah, nah. I don't know what's going on with Sevilla. Sevilla's in turmoil. Lens, shout out Lens, man. They surprised us. Surprised me at least. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they went to Europe. I think that's normal for Lens. They, they, I think a lot of people expected them to do decent after their good campaign last year, but. But yeah, I mean, I'm taking those. All I care about is first and second at the, at the end of the day. I'm taking that one. Hey, I got two out of four in that as well. So. Paris, okay. Group C, Madrid, top of it. Napoli second. And then Braga comes third. Union, Berlin going last. Again, I got the top two right. I'm taking that. I mixed up Union and Braga the last two, but I'm, I'm, not, I'm not too fussed about that. You know what I'm saying? Madrid, Napoli, first and second. Got it. Listen, I... I was not high. I'm not riding high on Napoli this season and for good reason honestly they have not been good they've sacked their manager already mid-season a lot of turmoil with Oshiman and stuff so I thought that was going to play into it but Union Berlin I did not realize how bad that they were going to be this season nah but like they were on like a 10 an absurd amount of losing streak going into Champions League and so I had them second Napoli was third for me Braga was fourth. No, nah, that, that's that a shocker because even if Napoli is doing poorly, like, come on, it's Braga. Dude, Union, I thought Berlin, Union Berlin were going to nah, do Union something, bro. Their team is not very good, bro. They signed Wash Bonucci and then they got Robin Gosens as their best players. Napoli aren't good in Europe usually, so. Didn't they? Didn't I mean, they what? They, I mean, huh? quarterfinal last year, not bad. But we beat them. Uh, smoked them, actually. Right, right, right. Okay, anyway. Group D. This was an interesting group. Yeah, for sure. Sociedad surprisingly <laughs> comes first in this group. Yeah. Inter second. Benfica goes out to Europa League. Salzburg bottom. Um, I had Salzburg right. You know what I'm saying? Got them bottom. But I had Inter first. I had Benfica going through. I underestimated Sociedad That's a, a little bit. I underestimated them. I That's can't. A stinker. It's not really a stinker. I don't know, man. But Fika had that cha has that Champions League heritage, bro, and I expect them to to pull it out. They they had some bad performances, especially, bro. That that Inter result where they were, they bottled the three 0 lead to Inter. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, it was so that? tough. Dang, yeah, you're right. But I had Inter going first. I had Real Sociedad going second, mm. Benfica third, Salzburg fourth. I had Real. I was riding high with Real Sociedad. If you watch the video, I was saying they had a, a really good team. They've got Ayarzabal, Kubo, um, Zuba Mendy's looking yeah, like a Zuba player. Yeah, Zuba Mendy's nice. Other, they're just like a unit. It's like one of those teams where they. It's not a lot of superstars. They just like they know how to play football as a team, and it's really showed. Inter and Real Sociedad did indeed tie on points, so it's not like still, I was super wrong. You're still to be wrong. Fair, though. You're still wrong though. 
Let's be real. Not too wrong, you know. Group E, Atleti topped it. Lazio second, Feyenoord third, Celtic, Celtic last. Not really any upsets in this group. Not at all. I tried to be different. <clears throat> I tried to be a little different. I went Spooky. Lazio top because Atleti were looking a bit weak at the time. But, I mean, to be honest, they're still looking somewhat fragile in certain games. But I went Lazio top. That was obviously wrong. I should have just went safe. Horrid. That's a horrible pick. I, I went, went I went Atleti second, though. The rest I got right. I went four for four. I went predicted this completely correct. As per, as per, that's your Atletico, first one. <laughs> Atletico first, that's a given. Lazio, you know what? I did. I was surprised about with Feyenoord because I think their home record is insane. And I've watched a couple of, of games when Feyenoord is at home and they turn up big. But so I was surprised that Lazio actually advanced, even though I predicted it. Lazio have just been super, super poor. Mid, mid, pretty Very mid. mediocre. Yeah, I can't lie. Celtic, of course. That, that goalkeeper scoring that goal for Lazio saved yeah. their, their campaign Fair pretty against much, against Atletico bro. as well. Mm -hmm. But we can move on, of course, to Group F. The group of death, of course, everyone knows who go, went through. Dortmund tops it. Mm -hmm. Second, PSG. AC Milan third. Tied on points with second. <laughs> third. Which is a bit like... Maybe Champions League's got to reevaluate, yeah. but uh, Newcastle fourth, yeah. which I think everyone's surprised by that. I think fourth and first are 100% surprises. Yeah, I mean, Dortmund, I can't lie. Dortmund shut everyone up. Everyone expected Dortmund to go out at least third or bottom. You know what I'm saying? They topped it, bro. That's pretty crazy. I had PSG topping the group. I had Newcastle going through second. I got Milan right at third. I had Dortmund last. I'll, I'll, Dortmund, I'll take the L on Dortmund. I can't lie. It's a shocker. Um, but I, in my opinion, bro, my opinion, my predictions weren't bad. If New, Newcastle should have went through, they were robbed. They nah, were robbed. Nah, nah, the, nah. the penalty against PSG, robbery. Nah, 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 nah. They, they just that one nil loss to Dortmund at St James was a freak result. You know, they they should have scored at least three in that game. Like, in my opinion, my predictions weren't bad. Fair enough on Dortmund, but Newcastle should have went through, bro. PSG shouldn't have gone through. I, agree. I don't know what I agree. You, anyone it, says. It should have been Dortmund and Newcastle. They shouldn't have gone through. No, <laughs> they shouldn't have gone through. Through There is a bit of shady refereeing in almost every game that PSG was playing. And they got I think AC Milan deserved to go through. Nah, 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 definitely not. They were like the only team that like barely, like every single game of theirs, like it was close. It wasn't like a thrashing. Same with Newcastle. Nah. What do you mean? How? What do you mean? How, Newcastle was like the same. The we same. smoked them. You didn't smoke at them. St. James. You didn't smoke nobody, bro. James. You did not smoke them. It was them. easy. We also destroyed them in the first leg when it was tied 0 0. We you had like 23 shots. Zero, zero. We had 23 shots. Or your PSG. On you got smoked by PSG. And we you, smoked them back. And Newcastle smoked PSG as well. And then? And then they got robbed. No, so. I don't I don't know. I think AC Milan, justice for AC Milan. We'll take your. You know what? We'll take Europa League. Small club mentality. No, we'll take Europa League. Oh, we'll you'll take, take Europa. Europa League after we'll being Europa. in the semifinal last year. That's crazy. Take crazy. Europa. But yeah, Group G. Uh, this one was pretty straightforward. Mm -hmm. City top it. Leipzig second. Young Boys got third. Red Star got last. I got yeah. the first two right. Same. Swapped Red Star and Young Boys. Didn't really give a toss about them, to be fair. <laughs> Same. Um, yeah. We group, move on. Group H. Four for four. For your boy. Same here. Oh, say swear. Swear. Same yeah, here. Yeah, we, we both predicted this group. It was pretty straightforward. Yeah. Barca, Porto, Shakhtar, and Antwerp. Yeah, I mean, Antwerp celebrated getting their first ever Champions League win. I think it was against Barca the last match day. Yeah. The, the scenes there were mad, even though they were, you know, guaranteed bottom. Yeah, yeah, for um, sure. Barca's a bit suspect, though. Definitely They suspect. got lucky they, with this group. Yeah, with this group. They're, I think, wait, who do they actually catch our next video? We got quarter or no, round of 16 predictions. Of course. We're going to talk about those games. But yeah, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I thought my predictions were better. I got 15 out of 32 correct you yeah and saying? i got 17 out of 32 despite getting zero zero for four in the group f which says a lot about <laughs> your predictions compared to mine look you know i try to be different in some of them but i'm gonna take it at the end of the day i think this is what gonna be the last ever group prediction oh, that's true. because that's true. champions league is a whole new format next, next year, year it's gonna be league format so re rest in peace to group stages in the rest champions in league peace. it's good that we did predictions for the last ever one you know what i'm saying Hit the like button, get in the comments, hit the sub button Please. as well.